I think China is in good hands. I think China is in in the right hands. So I, I think, um, uh, as I said, in the uh, last Congress, for me, um, the, the socialism with Chinese characteristics was something. So I could ask lots of questions about socialism with Chinese characteristics. Um, I think in this next phase, we will again ask the questions um, about um, how do you have um, socialism and the market economy? How do these two different concepts of, uh, of development uh, work together uh, to produce for the Chinese people what they want and what they deserve? But in the end, uh, the uh, concept that uh, Xi Jinping has written about the community of shared future, but it's the right way. The nations of the world don't need to fight each other, uh, to overpower each other, to take each other's markets, to take each other's resources, to take each other's water and mountains. The right way is for the world to deal with um, climate and health as a shared concern and work at it together. Uh, but I think China's doing that. I think China is working on sharing um, how to deal with climate and health in a very effective way. Uh, but it's, it's beginning to not look like that. It's beginning to look much more shared uh, than that concept. The, the digital um, Silk Road, the health Silk Road, other um, uh, current uh, Silk Roads are becoming the much more prevalent feature. How do you do that and achieve common prosperity? I think it's, uh, first of all, in, in the key concept that um, has come from, uh, from, um, from the leadership, uh, which is that um, you don't level down, you level up. And uh, you don't slow, you don't stop the economic development of, of uh, rich and wealthy people. That isn't the way to achieve common prosperity. You have to raise uh, the uh, GDP, you have to raise uh, the per capita, and yes, you give more poorer people than you gave uh, in different eras when nobody cared about them. Whatever it takes to maintain the development of China and to um, reward innovation for new uh, challenges that come along. Uh, while GDP growth is in this four to five percent range, which is the reasonable range of this era of the Chinese economy, the, the leveling up has to be um, more effective and uh, more efficiency, more capability. If I was able to come to China um, in the last two or three years, I would have found that they were working very hard on how to create a, a new uh, system for China that was streamlined and enabled more wealth to be released uh, to enable poorer people to gain more benefit.